Hey everybody, only doing a video blog today, no written word, I'm not in the mood. So I want to talk to you about morning rituals and we're going to get off marketing for a second. And I want to talk to you about, I know everybody's heard the importance of them and everybody's, not everybody, lots of people have a really good one that they want you to grab and stick to. I think the most recent uh, rave one has been the Miracle Morning and it's a great program. I don't mean to dismiss it, but here's what I want to say to you. Habits are personal and you have got to make it your own. You've got to modify it or tweak it and even if it's just in the tiniest way so that it really suits you. You as the absolutely individual human that you are. It's, it's a miracle how God created us to be all so similar and yet absolutely distinctive. But we are. You want to embrace that. You want to understand that when somebody else hands you an absolutely ready to go thing. It's not quite that way for you. And so, uh, morning rituals. Uh, so mine, because right, I'm going to tell you mine. I'm not going to say use it, but I'm going to tell you mine. Uh, mine started very much like the miracle morning. Uh, I've been, I was very slow to adopt this habit, very stubborn about it, even though all the science said it was a great thing. And, 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 and the people I knew who I liked the most, who seemed the most interesting and friendly, had some kind of a morning ritual. I still fought it. I'm scared, scared it's going to go all stuff. But anyway, that's my garbage. So uh, I start with meditation, and I've been doing meditation for years, and I still suck at it. So don't please use that as your excuse. I use an app on my phone. Uh, Calm, I'm not touting it, although it's a great one. It does its job. Uh, one of my favorites is a body scan. It's really simple, 15 minutes, but boom, boom. Helps me a lot with pain management, by the way, which I really appreciate. Um, then I get out my gratitude journal. And I do it in probably what is going to be conceived as a really quirky way. So the first thing I do is I write three statements of choice as though I choose and how I choose to show up for the day, right? Uh, you know, I might choose intention or clarity or fun, or whatever it may be, three of those. Uh, and then I offer some gratitude, right? I, I thank uh, the universe for the things that are coming my way that I'm looking forward to and expecting. And then I offer three statements of self-love, right? Yeah, it can be anything from my love light toes to I love my sense of humor, uh, no comments from the peanut ground, uh, or whatever it may be. Uh, also, by the way, at the end of the day, I add uh, three statements of um, what I thought I, I was really good at or what I contributed or what I offered or what I accomplished. Um, and, and this is um, to support me, to pat myself on the back, to fill me up because no matter how much we might get that from others, we could always use a little bit more of that stuff. The other morning ritual that I think is absolutely, absolutely imperative is the one that I use when I get in the office. And that is, for me, super simple, just like my morning thingy. Oh, I like to throw in, by the way, some exercise oxygen, oxygenization of some sort, although that is my least, least favorite aspect of my morning ritual, clearly. Um, I, I, it's hugely valuable. Okay. Morning in the office. Uh, so mine is really simple because any of you who have worked with me know that I can't even form full sentences some days. Uh, I like bullet points, you know, conjunctions evade me. So this is really simple. Projects, uh, people, people I need to reach, people who I'm waiting on to reach me. Uh, priorities for the day, right? Projects is probably going to be a little bit bigger scope. Then I come down here at the bottom at the end of the day. Um, and I review, I give myself a score. This is not for grading. Nobody's paying attention to the score I got. The point of it is to say, if I didn't make, give myself a great score, what got in my way? So I can learn to get those things out of my way. And then uh, a next, so I can walk in tomorrow morning with already a little bit of focus, a little bit of a, oh yeah, pick up where I left off kind of a thing. Stuff that dangled and, and new stuff that might have shown up throughout the day as well. Uh, so clearly this part is not done because it's not the end of my day. Uh, one page, really simple. Some people I know write novellas. Uh, there are lots of different ways to go about it. Uh, this is one of the few times I actually write. Uh, if Again, if we've worked together, you know about my opinion of the value of the hand-eye science, writing, all that junk. So I do that to feel more convicted to my outcomes uh, so that I can have more successful ones. Whatever system you choose, I do strongly suggest you keep it really kissy. Uh, and, and that you offer yourself the opportunity to check things off again scientifically that feels really good to us be like I did that right I nailed that one yeah oh I got that done we feel good it fills us up uh, okay that's what all I got
Have a lovely day, week, month, and I look forward to seeing you soon. Thank you so much.